Hey children, here are the weird things your brain does without asking you. Number one, you flinch before you even know what's happening. Have you ever knocked some object over and caught it instantly before it hit the ground and thought you'd achieve spidey sense? That's called a reflex, AKA the spinal reflex arc. It happens so fast that the signals don't even go all the way to your brain. They hit the spinal cord and the action is already done. It's one of the only systems in your body that can override thought completely. And your brain trusts it so much, it doesn't even check in. That's why you don't even know. And when your thoughts finally catch up after you've already reacted, that's your awareness lagging behind because it all happened in about 0.2 seconds. But it only happens when your instincts think it's a high threat, like knocked a glass and you saw a glance your mom is waiting with a belt, or touching something hot. So, yeah, you can pretty much say you're part-time Spider-Man. Number two, you feel someone staring at you before you look. You're sitting in a cafe, lost in your phone. Then something shifts. You feel it in your gut. Someone was staring. Because even while you were distracted, your brain wasn't. Your brain comes packed with high-tech gear. It can detect tiny movements and run subconscious threat detection through things like the amygdala and superior colliculus. It's the same reason you sometimes feel like someone's behind you when you're walking alone at night, even if no one's there. Number three, you solve problems in your sleep. You're almost done with your math homework, only one problem left, and you've been staring at it for nearly an hour. Since you're tired, you just go straight to bed, and when you wake up, the solution just pops up as soon as you look at the problem again. That's called your brain's default mode network. While you're sleeping, it sorts thoughts like puzzle pieces, it digs through clutter, tests connections, reruns what you gave up on. Even your dreams are sometimes part of the cleanup crew. You thought you were resting, but your brain was editing, especially the medial prefrontal cortex. And here's the cool part. You can totally train brain to solve the problems, just like training muscles at the gym. And that's exactly what Brilliant, the sponsor of today's video, helps you do. Brilliant is an interactive learning app that makes you a better thinker and problem solver. With thousands of visual lessons in math, science, programming, data, and even AI. You don't just watch videos, you do the learning. Every lesson breaks things down into small, clear steps and gives you problems to actually work through right then and there. It's not about memorizing, it's about understanding. You try, you think, you fail a bit, and then it clicks. That's how your brain levels up for real. It's like a workout, but for your brain. And whether you're deep into STEM or just casually curious, there's a course that fits where you're at. And the best part, you can try everything Brilliant has to offer free using my link. And you'll also get 20% off a premium annual subscription. Just hit the link in the description or scan the QR code on screen. Special thanks to Brilliant for sponsoring today's video. Number four, your brain's autopilot mode. You ever walk all the way home, unlock your door, and realize you don't remember the whole journey until you're home? That's not forgetfulness. That's your brain doing two things at once, just like our computers. And that's called automaticity. When a routine gets practiced so deep, your brain hands it off to the background systems and frees up your conscious mind to think, dream, or stress about literally anything else. And it's the same reason you get shower thoughts. Because your body's on autopilot, and your brain finally has space to connect weird ideas, solve stuff, or start a fake argument, you'll never actually win. This sign isn't about instinct like flinching. It's about trust. Your brain is handling the outside world while your mind goes somewhere else. And thinking our brain could do such coordination is just amazing. Number five, your emotions remember things you forgot. You smell something random, like your grandma's cologne, a street food, or the air after rain, and your whole chest tightens. You don't even remember why, but the feeling hits hard. That's because olfactory signals go directly to the limbic system, especially the amygdala and hippocampus. Unlike other senses, smell skips the thalamus, so it hits emotion fast and hard, sometimes without conscious memory. That's why a scent can trigger a powerful emotional reaction, even if you don't remember the source. And sometimes, it reminds you when you least expect it. Number six, you hear things that never happened. You ever feel your phone buzz, but there's no notification? Or you hear someone called your name? That's not just you being paranoid. That's your brain predicting reality before it even happens. It's called phantom vibration. When a habit gets deep enough, your brain starts expecting it and fills in the blanks. Even if nothing happened, like hearing a voice in your head while reading a message. 
It's not imagination, it's memory, your auditory cortex firing like it's real. Because your brain doesn't just wait for sounds, it guesses them. And sometimes it's so sure, it forgets to ask if they're real. If you want to watch more video like this, subscribe to my channel. See you.